Hey guys, the objective of this video is to run through an um, example or a question related to the isentropic efficiencies. So our question states that 1.5 kilograms per second of air enters an adiabatic compressor at pressure of 1 bar and room temperature which is 25 degrees Celsius. So if the air is compressed to 8 bar, calculate the actual work required to drive the compressor if it has an isentropic efficiency of 90%. Also calculate the rate of entropy generated. So if we have our diagram over here, we have that the pressure at the initial state is going to be 100 kilopascals, and the temperature at the initial state is going to be 25 degrees Celsius. And since we are working with air, which is an ideal gas, this needs to be in Kelvin. At state 2, we have our pressure to be 8 bar, which is 800 kilopascals, and our T2 is um, as yet unknown. We also know, due to the steady state, steady flow assumption, that the mass flow rate going into the system has to equal to the mass flow rate going out of the system. And since the mass flow rate going into the system is only at state 1, and the mass flow rate going out of the system is only state 2, it follows that m1 dot is going to equal to m2 dot. We also know that the compressor is adiabatic, so we have our control volume over here, um, and we will have the... Uh, there will not be any heat transfer out of the system.